Jose Waldo. I want to fight him in my city. Rio de Janeiro. Daddy's coming home. Dana White, let's sign that contract. Well, if you choose to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and stand and trade with this young man, you're playing with fire. Frightening knockout power. Go look at the highlight reel. As good a reel as anybody in the sport, you can be sure he'll be looking to find a home for those heavy hands early and often. You do not want to get in a slugfest with this young contender, I can assure you of that. This fighter has an iron jaw. I have seen him take shots on the chin and not be affected. Shots that would knock a lesser man completely unconscious. So here he is, folks, the 2008 Olympic gold medalist in freestyle wrestling, Henry Cejudo, challenged Demetrius Johnson for the UFC Flyweight Championship. When he has tried to take down an opponent in the UFC, he's been able to do so. That includes Mighty Mouse. We really, though, have seen a boxing-heavy attack in the UFC. Outstanding hand speed on the Phoenix, Arizona native, Henry Cejudo. This guy is one of the toughest guys I have ever seen inside the Octagon. His ability to absorb punishment and then come back from it is just absolutely incredible to watch. Outside leg kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Right on the button. Well, he left his body wide open there for that hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed, and the opposition took full advantage there. Oh, so an interesting decision there is he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Throwing that jab, no good. That one hurt. Very nicely done. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. First takedown attempt is there. He's got the arm trapped of his opponent. Good defense. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Another shot lands upstairs. Good sequence wow. of kicks there. Whoa! He's got him hurt here. The champ is rocked. He's in deep trouble right now. Deep trouble. He's trying to hang on. Back up. Big oh, beautiful man. elbow. Too. 
hard straight punch. no doubter Joe and he's made a career of knocking guys out with kicks but that one right there might have just been the best yet caught the opponent flush full force outstanding extension with the leg and really once he connected with the target you knew the end of the fight was coming and immediately his opponent goes to the canvas a major major result here in this division tonight and here we see it one more time look at the timing in this shot crank right on the jaw So what a knockout from the UFC lightweight champion here tonight. Under the bright lights, he rises above the pressure and gets it done in a big way. Trademark inside leg kick there by Good Sergio. shot. Oh, connects with the one-two. Lands a big right hand early. He is going after it here. Trying to get a head kick in. Oh, body kick is there for Cejudo. They have oh! He is in trouble. Nice oh! Oh! up here in half guard nice hammer fist the ground strikes continue to pile up back to half guard and busy as he looks to improve position here that one hurt Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Good shots by the champion. Tags him. There's a good knee to the body. Oh, oh he's got to be careful oh. here. Oh. oh, look at that. That'll do it. Unbelievable. A huge kick for the knockout victory. Yeah, Joe, knockouts don't get much more prettier or much more flush than that. Full force and full extension on the kick, and there was no chance after that, Joe. The fight was really over as soon as that kick made contact. An outstanding highlight for that young fighter here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Great angle here. I mean, just stiff. And there is the UFC lightweight champion proving tonight he can not just get it done, but get it done with style points as he gets the knockout 